Hey what's up guys hope you all are doing well today i am back with another video so enjoy the video Lately experimenting with the new framework for mobile app development having already built project with one of the popular frameworks for web development view.js why not try native script view native script as you might have guessed or know is a mobile application development framework that uses javascript but how it builds the app is a whole different story to be told before moving on i built this app for my aunt who was having trouble downloading songs from youtube she isn't into the world for searching and downloading mp3s or music streaming apps. However, she was used to earlier app for searching and downloading music like TubeMate. So, I coded this project for her which allows search and download only the audio tracks of the YouTube videos. I will provide the APK in the link as well and anyone wanting to build or have a look at the code you are welcome to so to run this project which is also in my github repository it's tns run android bundle just wait a moment as it searches for any android device connected in usb debugging mode which i have it will take some time I will quickly pull up the screen recording of my phone while this is running as well. Terminal says it successfully installed and blah blah. All debugging information. So in the console, the path where the file will be downloaded along with the name of the file is song. Now it's staring in my phone with the native script spas screen. You may search for any video as you would on YouTube and I will list few of the results. Then you may tap on the thumbnail and in the new page tap the download music to download. Now. How it downloads is a fun part. I wrote the service in node.js and ran it in Heroku that will stream the audio track from the server to the app. And the app will save the stream as an audio file in the local downloads folder. Since my internet is quite slow, I will fast forward it too. So. Download has been completed and I built a music player into the app. Cool, right? Or no? So, this will list all the music files downloaded only from this app and you can play the tracks, delete it. Though my aunt just uses it to download the music and the C uses the stock music app on her phone. So, I am grateful to have learned programming to solve something from my loved one more than anything. So, thank you guys this much for today. See you soon in next video. Till then, stay safe and stay home. And don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And if you have any queries, please let us know down below in the comment section. Take care.